If you've always wondered the way to remove background from your video without using the chroma key or green screen effect, then watch this video to the end. I'm about to share five ways that you can remove background from your videos without using the green screen effect. Are you excited already? So am I. Let's jump right into the video. Hey there! If you have a smartphone, you would want to binge on my channel. And every week I teach you one thing that you can do with your smartphone or a tip on how to make money online with your smartphone. Don't miss subscribing and turning on notifications so you don't miss a single video from my channel. You are welcome to my channel. If this is the first time you're watching a video from me, you're welcome. I would like you to subscribe to this channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss a video on this channel. And if you're a returning viewer, you are also welcome. I realize so many people actually return to view my content and I'm really 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 grateful for your time on my channel so the first thing i would love you to do before we get started is to hit the thumbs up hit the like button down below so that the algorithm can share this video with small people with this let's get started so in capwing you also do not use need to use green screen okay now i'm going to tap on start editing i'm going to tap on start editing so i'm going to tap on um plus okay to bring in my subject or bring in my videos so i'm going to tap on click to add a video okay capwing is going to ask, ask you to um you know log in so this is the video all right that i'm using this is the video of, of the lady that i'm using so it is going to process it okay okay it's done all right so i am going to tap on this button over here okay i'm going to tap on edit video okay so we can find where to remove the background okay so effects all right so under effects i'm going to tap on remove background so you can see chroma key is also in cap wing all right if i use a chroma key it's always quite better but i'm going to and then i'm going to set the threshold okay and then i'm going to tap on done so let's see what it did all right so you can see that there are still some edges the edges of this video was not cut out okay the edges of this video so you can see how not using a green screen can actually work for you so i believe you would rather use um okay let's increase the threshold all right and see how it works so now the threshold now started cutting in so you can see that that part of the body all right if this subject was in an actual place you know just stable it would be a lot better okay just as i said okay but you can see how cap wing um did with the remover okay you can see how it did with the remover okay so this is this is um the second threshold so it's still um kind of bringing in the background sort of okay so now let's try chroma key okay let's try chroma key so you can see um green or blue okay so let me tap on key to color so let me select that orange color okay i, I hope uh-huh so it, it didn't actually do well because as i tapped on that orange color the, the background is not strictly orange okay so you can see how um you can also use your um cap wing okay you can also use cap wing to remove background from your video but i believe you wouldn't even try to use this at all okay so that's for cap wing next let's go to another one that is also very awesome so the next web app we are using for re background remover is called bigrem okay so you go to bigrem.delv.com all right and select so upon reaching here i'm going to tap on the upload video all right you can see that um the maximum resolution is 90 9, 1920 by 9 10 80 okay and you can't go above 60 seconds except if you register okay you go get to three minutes okay so um of course you you might want to go for the pro version to get more all right so i'm going to tap on the upload video and select the video of choice okay which is this video all right so right here you're going to select the background so i'm just going to leave it at this one okay this is the one without a background all right because if i change it to this it's just going to change the background completely okay so i'm going to use this one all right so i'm going to tap on the confirm confirm okay so we just wait for it to take off the background all right we're going to wait for it to take off the background all right so it's done so this is the result this is the result the background is removed so i'm going to tap on the download all right so here is the video okay i'm going to tap on the download 
okay all right so the video is downloaded and ladies and gentlemen that is the fourth way to remove background from your video all right so the third one is CapCut. okay it's an application i've also done several tutorials on that i'm going to leave on the on the description so when i tap on the new project i'm going to select my video okay so this is the video i want to use okay so this is the video that i want to use i think i selected this video three times i knew it so i'm just going to delete 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 okay so we have the video right here so i'm going to select on the video and you can see remove background okay so on removing the background it have already erased the background but you can see slightly as the subject is moving her hand that the background is showing up again so like i said this is going to be a lot perfect if the background also if the subject does not move just keeps the hand stable all right so that's for cap cord. so now let's move to the next one If all you do with your smartphone is to make an answer call, move from Facebook to TikTok to Instagram and WhatsApp, and then to take cool and awesome pictures, guess what? You are underusing and abusing your smartphone. No wonder, out of 5.5 billion people in the world that owns a smartphone, 87.8% has admitted to smartphone addiction. And the problem here is that their smartphone is depriving them of their life. But I have the good news. Over the past two years, I've created 100 plus videos on practical things you can do with your smartphone. These videos are things I've done over the past five years in the smartphone productivity and profitability industry. And it's going to teach you digital skills and also several things that you can do to boost your productivity and also make money online with your smartphone. If it's not what I've done, I won't be talking about it. So since you're always on your smartphone, use your smartphone to make the rest of your life the best of your life. Click the link down below to get a copy right now. Okay, so you're just going to go to on screen. I've already opened it initially on screen.com. So if you've used remove.bg before, this is also one of their platforms. All right. This is also one of their applications actually all right so i'm going to select um tap on the upload clip all right and then i'm going to select file so i'm going to bring in the video that i am going to be removing the background so there's some things you need to note about on screen okay even all the rest of the um, ai uh, apps for background remover we are going to be talking about if you are going to be moving about in the video just like i said if you're going to be moving about in the video waving your hand the ai might actually cut off that part of your hand that is being moved out of your body so you can see this girl why this one is going to be very perfect is that the subject here is maintaining a specific position and then her hand is not moving outside the body okay because the ai is only um i recognizing the body okay so once you move the person kind of moves her hand outside away from the body is going to cut it out okay going to assume that is part of the background okay so that is one of the things you need to ensure if you're going to be using on screen on screen as you can see that the clip limit clip length limited to five seconds okay so in the free version you're not going to have more than nine seconds of your destiny okay so if you are going to be going pro the pro is actually available so process with pro you have to sign up and go for the pro but that is on screen okay for background remover with chroma key okay so this is the point when you use a distinct background okay we use your green screen to shoot your video okay so i'm going to tap on the plus sign. i'm just going to bring in a video of myself shot on a green screen okay so this is one of the videos i shot on a green screen and um, i'm going to bring it in so let's crop let's crop right let's crop splits and delete this part then okay let's keep it right here split and delete this part okay so we have a video right now of me okay so let's 
crop it again let's crop it edit then crop all right so this is practically what i do on my videos okay after shooting i crop the ss okay okay so cropped so this is the video right now so i am now going to select on the video okay and um, go to my chroma key go to my chroma key where is it so this is the chroma key so i'm going to drop it right here on the green then intensify okay and we are what done okay so i just reduced the intensity and we are done okay so you can see today i am going to be teaching you how perfect for it is we are going to be designing four right important designs this that is you how perfect it is the first one okay is your so that is how your chroma key works on CapCut. okay so which of these are you going to be using more let's talk about it on the comments so right now, between these AI applications I shared and using our normal chroma key or green screen effect, which one is going to be more effective? Now, if you're going to use the AI applications, there are some things you need to actually ensure. Now, I tried while trying out different videos, I discovered that if the subject or the person you're recording is, you know, moving around, all right, the, the AI um, app is actually going to be picking up at the edges of the person, that background that's supposed to have been removed okay unlike when that video was shot on a green screen it won't actually do that whether the person is moving dancing or whatever the background will remain erased okay so you need to ensure that first that you're using the tripod and then you're not moving around in the video just stand still watch the video watch the camera and shoot the video then you'll be fine so that means using someone to shoot i i, I tried this with a video that someone you know held and um, recorded and i found out what i'm talking about right now so unlike when you use a green screen effect okay so the reason why people still have fine challenge with um, using green screen effect are actually just few especially when your green screen is not well like that so that some part is dark you know a darker green than the other part is lighter green so when you have a well lighted studio and then use the green screen effect just back on the chroma key on either adobe premiere pro tap cord final cut pro um king master then your green screen is gone right so i still think even though i mentioned all of this that using the chroma key effect or green screen effect is much more effective in removing background from your video Was that video helpful? You might want to watch more tutorial videos on my channel like the one I released recently and then hit the subscribe button up here and ring the bell so you'll always be the first to know when I release a fresh video. That is if you want to keep watching videos from me and of course you want to. <laughs> my name is Frederick. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one.